joystick for pan tilt and then zoom focus around on the controller box there. to have a little more light, but I don't know if it really would have, you know, I think, you know, we've got a certain theme in our movie, and there is a kind of a dark theme, and I think the plane will look good, you know, part of the rain kept the planes out of the airport and the boats off the lake, right? I think when you see the footage, it'll be so like, holy shit, that's like, Scott, you know, space camp, you know, that ain't no Tyler Mallard, you know, off the ground, that's like, you know, a chase along the takeoff, and a come around, and a tail away, and a, it's gonna look great. Uh, Dave Schultz, the uh, director, writer, you're asking me what it's like to work with him. He is uh, Cuckoo Riff. He's completely, completely energized, bunnied out. He, I never met him, talked to him on the phone, arrived, two hours of the makeup trailer was enough to make him stop drinking coffee. I mean, the guy is such a sweet, smart guy. You know what I mean? So, so, um, but he really knows his stuff, and he's, uh, he doesn't have an ego, he's modest, he's smart, um, we're shooting this in 17 days, God bless us, again, it's another one of these features that you, you, you just shoot seven pages a day, which is like Black Hawk Down, when I filmed that movie, we were fil filming an eighth of a page a day, you know, it was just a complete, but that's okay, it's a different money zone movie, and, but they're trying to get more out of the dollar today than they've ever done before. And so you really have to come prepared. And I, I have only been on set one day. And Dave was uh, fantastic. Yeah, really prepared. And the grips are flying around. And everyone's flying around. So it's, I, I, hopefully it's looking good. Working with Dave has been fantastic. I could not have asked for a better person to lead me through you know, my first real film experience. He's just, he has a vision. And I respect his vision, and we trust each other, and I think that's really important when the actor trusts the director, when the director trusts the actor. Um, it just allows for really good communication, and I think that his vision is coming clear. You know, it's coming through clear to me. It's, and I, I'm hoping that I'm doing a good job to you know transpose that on film. When I when I grew up in Saskatoon, movies were like you know made in Hollywood. That's it. You know, and soap operas are made in New York, and stage was in Stratford, and no. So now to to come full circle graduating like I did way back in 81 and now coming back to my home province to do a movie is uh, it's just a great thing and I think Regina in Saskatoon not quite so much but Regina has just become this 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 boiling pot of of series with corner gas and now features and it's it's just a great place to shoot a movie I mean before the snow and the ice hit it's it's great to be here what you're seeing here is a collection of a lot of people who sort of rallied around to support a great script and a, you know, a talented guy in Dave and a beautiful script in 45 RPM. A lot of them have opportunities to work on numerous projects and they've come on board this one because something in the script touched them. And I think, you know, for me, that's, those are the kinds of people I like to work with and this is the kind of project I like to do. And to me, it's been really rewarding to be surrounded by all these types of people. Take my hand! Come on! Come here! Print that one. Beautiful. You know, it's I've made a lot of different types of movies, a lot of different genres, um, and people have, are always asking me, what's your favorite? And I always tell them the same thing. It was something that I was told many years ago by one of my mentors, who was, a, you know, now semi-retired from the business, but he said, you know, these films are like our children. We dress them up in the best clothes that we can afford, and we send them out in the world and just hope somebody loves them. And that's all I really hope for this movie. You can't ever, you know, you start the movie and you can't ever see finishing. And then before you know it, you got all the pieces. And you got your movie. And then five years it goes by and you're trying to do something else.